Race four is the only two-year-old race on the card. It's a one-mile race on the straight course. And at the top, we've got Lincoln for Alex Cherry. Then Conrad Liggett's got the next two. Destiny Mountain and Mr. Silver Line in Chinny. St. Mark's Basilica for David Hooley. Cabo Fito for Darren Thompson. Mainland Centre, David Robertson. Del Monte for Derek Hinton, who's also got Life is Too Short. Mexican Cowboy for Leon Van Rinsburg. Outlander Martin Liedham. Torrential for... Paul Rhodes, see you then for Graham Clutterbuck. That one probably like a few hurdles in the way. Fast pick for David Hooley, La Terza for Darren Thompson, Swiss Matic Piccolo, David Robertson, Onslaught and Zaf Zala for Craig Allen, Madeline for Joshua Sutherland, Parting Ways for Leon Van Rensburg, Poe Valley, Martin Liedham, Hair Raising, Paul Rhodes, Silk Dress, Graham Clutterbuck, and Bronx Cave Girl and Moyoshi Electric for Vinnie Gerard. Good big field again, spread right across the track, probably split into three off they go. And Who's going to be the first one out? Looks like Del Monte was quickly away right over on that far side. Might just about be in the lead. Onslaught is also up there parting ways down on this near side with St Mark's Basilica up the centre of the track. With also Outlander is also close up. But right over on the far side, Del Monte is the leader of that group of three over there. Down on this near side, parting ways leads them on this side. Not the centre of the track. You've got Outlander and Fast Pick. Also Mexican Cowboys also near the front as well. And they're already quite well strung out as they come down towards the final five and a half furlongs and parting ways on this near side is probably just in the lead if you see them past this point you can just about see that the near side's got it parting ways in front then from del monte right over on the far rail then fast pick up the centre with st mark's basilica down on this near side also over on the far side destiny mountain is trying to get into it down on this rail as well but it's parting ways who's still in the lead by about a length or so i'd say the one with a black cap coming through there nice and i think he's fast pick st mark's basilica is doing all those two in similar colors del monte right on the far side sticking on got no company really is the other two on the far side not going all that well although onslaught is trying to run on and the center of the track outlander's now trying to come through with a run look at this destiny mountain come from nowhere as well but they've still got to get to parting ways inside the final two furlongs it's parting ways on this near side in the lead right over on the far side onslaught is now taking over that group up the center of the track destiny mountain moyashi electric's coming through one as well tozu torrential and capo feet over there inside the final furlong and now parting ways begins to tie up here comes moyashi electric Marshy Electric swoops through into the lead, being challenged immediately by Zafsala and Ryder right on the far side, Torrential and Cabal Fito and now down this near side, Zafsala's just got it, Zafsala, the Terza Torrential, lots of them finishing pretty quickly, Mexican Cowboy was a surprisingly, was surprisingly tailed off at the back from one of the top stables, but it was... Very close in the end to be a Craig Allen 1 2. He definitely won both sides of the track. But you can see the one on the other side of the track, Onslaught, didn't even make the top six. So Zaf Sala takes it for Craig Allen. Torrential for Paul Rhodes was second. Myoshi Electric for Vinnie Gerard third. Cabo Fito for Darren Thompson was fourth. And Hair Raising for Paul Rhodes again was fifth.